What's up, what's up, Wasabi? What's going on, guys? I'm Eric Surf Six. Welcome to another episode of Eric Meal Time. Hey, Lincoln, what are we doing today? Uh, snow barbecue. Snow barbecue. Unreal. Yeah, and we're getting there by snowmobile. What's on the menu, you ask? Oh yeah, what's on the menu? We got ice cold beers on ice. Ice cold beers on ice. You got enough ice? <laughs> I forgot the ice, Lincoln. What are we gonna do? Yep. We've got strawberries, they're in season, and they're giant in Hokkaido. Look at the size of these things. Some grapes. There's some meat from last night. We'll reheat that. Yeah. CC lemon. Ooh, look at that. Not sure what that is. Here's the meat. Oh, oh, oh. this is budogogi. We've got some uh, Japanese meat as well too. This is uh, karabi, gyu karabi. Got some sweet Japanese onions. These are nice. We've got extra tare for the meat, just in case we need extra sauce. We probably don't, because these are marinated already. Got these tangerines. Perfect for juggling. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And Hokkaido asparagus, this stuff is the bomb. Lemon for seasoning. So barbecue in the snow from Hokkaido, Japan. We'll start with the salad course, which is fruit. <laughs> I'm gonna go for the reddest one. This guy, not the biggest one, the reddest one. The ripest one, this will be the sweetest one. Well, oh, it looks amazing. Yeah, here goes. Oh, so sweet. Let's go for the bigger one. This will be a little more sour, maybe. Look at how it's like white on top. That is a delicious strawberry. Oh, fantastic. Speaking of strawberries, have you guys seen my strawberry eating video where I eat at this strawberry farm? It's got 20 million views for some odd reason. And the only thing I do is just eat 25 strawberries. It's an all you can eat strawberry farm. I'll put a link to it if you want to check it out. And at the end of that video, there's something really, really special and dear to me that has nothing to do with the strawberries. Yeah, maybe that's why it went viral. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, I was raised like eating these. That's the way my mom taught us. It's like you can eat that as well too, the green. Mm-hmm. Yep. It's all edible. These are amazing. So good. I better save some for the boys. Grapes. Oh my gosh, grapes. Look at these guys. I'm pretty sure they're seedless. Nope, they've got seeds. Very juicy. Mmm. Mmm, not too bad at all. And speaking of grapes, have you guys seen my grape eating video? I ate these ginormous grapes, like they were the size of like golf balls, no exaggeration. And I had them hanging from my room. And I, I think what I did, I was, it's been, it was a long time ago, but that video got eight million hits for some odd reason. And I was just doing this. Mm -hmm. And I did it with a whole like bunch of grapes. These, it were golf ball size. This is turning into just one large commercial for my old YouTube videos. Yay! Check them out. Link's right up here. Got to elevate the barbecue off of the snow or it's going to melt. So yeah, that'll work. This meat looks awfully familiar. Yeah, man. Hmm. This is what happens when you can't eat everything. You know, take them home next yeah. day. <laughs> and it's still just as good, isn't it? You can eat these fries just cold. They're still amazing. I think I should barbecue them a bit. Well, a little on the soggy side. Barbecue french fries, this is a first. Um, the yakiniku sauce that we chose has garlic in it and it's just pretty potent. Oh, 
hot, hot, hot. Okay, next up, this is a first. This is tempura rice balls on the barbecue. Okay, searching for the perfect rice ball. Barbecue rice ball, maybe? Hmm, good? <laughs> Different. Sausage, any, any straight up the barbie. Oh, it's, it's easy. I mean, it's, oh, I didn't know. Yeah, same. Might as well. Yeah. Okay, so this is thinly sliced bulgogi Korean beef. You it's already time. marinated. Look at that. First time you. This tried? is better than the first take. <laughs> Camera was not rolling on the first take, <laughs> but this is a better slice. The question is, is it spicy or not? <laughs> it is not but it's in a really nice sauce. We're gonna mix the onions with the bulgogi. Mm-hmm, that's what we're doing. Oh, that's the way to do it, with the onions. All right, we got the next meat now. This is the gyu katabi. Mm-hmm, yep, the beef short rib. Yeah, it's cooking now. We're in the shade here. It's a little bit hard to see with the asparagus and the onion. So the question is, is this better than the bulgogi Korean meat? It is. I think we cooked it a little bit too much. Mm, it's tasty. It's in a real sweet sauce. Oh, some good meat. Yummy. Well, it's a barbecue in the snow. It was a beautiful day. Great company. Great food. It's a nom nom nom. I'm giving away three. Get some snack packs. The only thing you have to do for your chance to win is put a comment down below. If you're not familiar with the Get Some Snack Packs, there's a link right up here. You can check out all the cool stuff that I give away from Japan. I'll choose three winners and they'll be announced in the next video. So get busy commenting down below. I want to thank you guys for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Ready for some really bad one-liners? Here we go. Watch out for the clip. Watch out for the clothes. Watch out for all the great links on the screen. Go ahead, click around, party on, team get some.